Hello YouTube music building community, this is Marcos from Tortuga Costumes. Um, I want to thank you all for the um, kind words on my last video uh, from the from the show. And uh, I want to make a, a, an update on my Daytona. So far I got it, <laughs> all the chassis is done. The only thing that I have left is doing the reinforcement on, on some certain areas and the engine is in the in place um, I'm gonna make uh, I'm gonna scratch build a cow hood and I'm gonna lift the distributors out so these are the stands that's gonna there is gonna be it's not gonna be more lower than that it's gonna be that's the really high that it's gonna be I just finished with the tops, the wheel tops, I mean, and they are not dry yet, but I just uh, glue in place the, the angle pieces on the side windows, and so far it's looking real good. So let me show you now the, the chassis itself, okay? Hold on a little bit. Okay, back to the chassis. So the chassis, like I said, is all done. Uh, this has been a challenge actually <laughs> um, there's a few parts that I that I know I'm not proud of but this is my first full scratch bit chassis so I think it's, it's good to have all the, those mistakes so I can be better in the future and uh, like I said um, the wheel tops are, are really worth the, the it was the tough part to do and uh, um, it's been it's been it's been a good cool thing to scratch build all these things and it's been really fun so uh, the only thing that I have left like I said is reinforcement in some certain areas like this one for, for example it's open right now but I'm gonna fill it up and uh, make it smooth and here too in the, in the angle part of, from the tops and um, there's some areas I mean the chassis itself is really hard I mean I, I did a really good job on it but there's some some parts that I just added on and uh, that they need to be a little bit more hard or more strong that's the word strong and to do and to do to the chassis himself and uh, this is this is I mean this is almost done the only thing that I have left to do is inside the the dashboard I'm gonna put I'm gonna add another piece over there so I can add the, the tag and stuff like that and then smooth it out the single parts and uh, add some structure here so I can they can be a little bit more strong so after that there's not much to do I mean it's just paint and starting to do, um, put in place all the pieces that I have um, detail up and um, what else um, yeah this is that well, that's what it basically is and after I have all that things on done, there will be the painting of the body. That will be another challenge because I want to do something different with this one. I want to do a three-tone job and uh, I know that's going to be hard for me because it's going to be my first time doing that. Actually my second time, but the first time it was so bad that I didn't blow any videos of it. <laughs> And uh, um, so far, this is what I got. Well, I hope you guys like it. I mean, I love it so far. This is my, by far, one of my favorite builds that I have done. And um, it's been all a scratch build, and is it is something that I really like. Um, I think that I'm gonna keep doing these drag cars. <laughs> Um, I mean gassers and dry cars, Pramas, Pro, Pro Stock, Pro Street. 
stuff like that. I mean, I like I like those things and I really enjoy it. It's not that I'm not gonna be building factory cars and stuff like that and crazy ideas, but this is basically what what I do like. This is this is really 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 fun. It's a lot of work, but it's fun as hell, man. I can tell you. And well, see you guys. I think next time, right? <laughs> and like I said, I I'm 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 pretty pleased with uh, all the awesome comments that I got from my last video. And um, um, from the show, I didn't say nothing on the last video because it was only pictures. But I really got the chance to meet Charlie Mack over there on the show. On the show, and um, his wife, obviously. And uh, the, um, I mean, it was all I was expecting. I mean, he's an amazing guy. A lot of fun to chat on. I mean, uh, seeing the videos. I mean, seeing his videos and hear him talking on his video is nothing compared to what you can learn and talk and chat with this guy. I mean, I have a blast with him. Um, obviously, I've made, uh, I was with uh, Chris from the uh, Diablo's Workshop and I met him a couple times in a couple, couple different shows and he's one hilarious guy too. I mean, he got a, he wants to keep the, the the hobby going. I mean, I got a moment with him, um, very last moment of the show before he left to to to, to New York, and he was trying to convince my son to build a model. I mean, he loved model, but he loved more video games than, than models, and he was trying to get encourage him. And for me, that was one of the best part of the show because he was interacting with my son and obviously with me, of course, but you know, he tries to keep the, the model, the model um, community going. It's not just stop with us. I mean, I want to my, my kids doing the same thing as I do, but it would be awesome to see them continue our, our hobby because this is, this is something that keep your mind going and, and keep you healthy in certain ways if you take the, the right precautions for those for paint and and uh, glue and stuff like that well guys um, enough for me chatting so I hope to you guys like the video and later on I'm gonna be doing a detailed video of this thing especially with the engine because it's been a lot of work on that one on that part and uh see you guys soon okay bye bye